Hey guys, make sure to stay until the end. We want to share one good advice with you. That way you do not end up being stuck in the middle of nowhere and you don't end up spending thousands of dollars in future repairs. Hey guys, welcome back to Free Car Repair. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be a super helpful video to any of you guys having a Ford Edge that generation here from year 2010 to year 2014. If you need to find guys where the trailer tail lights fuse is located, which fuse controls the trailer tail lights, where you can find it on Ford Edge, where you can buy cheap parts, tools, fuses, realize at a good price, quick shipping, that way you do not waste money and time. Why well, it's always a good idea to test fuses and realize all that guys will be covered absolutely free for your convenience. Make sure you stay until the end. Before we start guys, let us tell you a little bit about us. Every single car we get here at the garage guys, we try to make at least two to 300 free repair videos. We take them completely apart on our YouTube channels. We show you how to fix transmissions, engine codes. This channel specifically will be for fuses guys. And we have more than 14,000 free repair videos on our YouTube channels that can save you thousands of dollars in future repairs. Now, if you need help with anything, if you're in the middle of nowhere guys, and you need to find, let's say the fuse on that for edge for a fuel pump, for anti-theft system, alarm system, ignition codes, fuel injectors, anything like that, all you have to do, find the video on our channel, watch it in less than a minute or two, you're back on the road, guys. So that's why we make these videos to save you as much money and time as we can. So guys, for the trailer, tail lights, fuse, okay, which fuse we need to check. If you need to check the stop brake light or the turn signal light, it's different fuse, we have the video on the channel. We will demonstrate on this generation 4 edge. Most people that own that 4 edge uh, do not know about all the hidden fuse boxes, guys. That's why we made a special video on our YouTube channel about fuse box location on 4 edge. Check it out if you need help with that. The trailer tail lights fuse is located under the hood. Open the hood here, facing the engine on the driver's side, we have that fuse box. Here, what you guys need to do, Press these two tabs, open the cover, and you're going to find a fuse box with a layout like this one here. Before we continue, let's explain quickly why it's always a good idea to test fuses and relays. So let me explain why it's super important guys to test fuses. Fuses, not often you can see if they're burnt or they're good. Sometimes they may seem perfectly fine, you think it's a good fuse, you put it back in and you end up uh, spending money and time on parts and problems that, that do not exist guys. When all you have to do, test your fuse, find out it's bad, replace it, fix your problem. So we will have a video how to test a fuse, okay, different kinds of fuses and how to test relays guys. We're going to put the link in the description of the video below specifically to that video please check it out guys one fuse that we'll need to check you will have this fuse only if you have factory original trailer system installed on your ford edge if it's aftermarket you will not have that fuse please make sure to stay until the end we want to share one good advice with you that way you do not end up being stuck in the middle of nowhere like it happened to us now here we're going to zoom in and guys, if you come in that row of fuses here on the on this side, okay, we need to start counting now. Fuse number 87, 86, 85, 84. Ours does not have a factory trailer system, but if you have one, that will be the fuse, guys, that you will need to check right there. So guys, this generation Ford Edge has all kind of different fuses and relays. Fuses and relays that could be really hard to find, especially if you live in a small town, if you're in the middle of nowhere. One time we needed a replacement fuse, we couldn't get one and as a result we were stuck there for a few days until shipment came so we we'll recommend to keep some of those spare ones in the glove box for a peace of mind so that thing doesn't happen with you we'll put a link in the description of the video below where you can get it from hopefully the video will be helpful if you have any questions don't hesitate to let us know thank you guys for watching and see you next time